Harry Potter is a student at Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry. Over the summer, he goes to stay with the Weasleys, who take him to see the Quidditch World Cup. When he arrives at Hogwarts, he finds that the school is playing host to two other wizarding schools, Bobaton and Durmstrang. The Triwizard Tournament will be being held there. It is a contest that determines which of the three schools will take home the Triwizard Cup. A student from each of the schools will be chosen by the Goblet of Fire to participate. They have to pass three challenges to win. Along with Cedric Diggory, Fleur Delacour, and Victor Crumb, Harry is chosen. This is against the rules, as Harry is underage and Cedric has already been chosen as a school champion. The first challenge is to defeat a dragon and steal the golden egg it's protecting. Harry uses a summoning charm to bring his broomstick to the arena and manages to get the egg. The egg opens and reveals that the next challenge has something to do with mermaids. Just before the competition, Ron and Hermione disappear. Harry eats gillyweed, which gives him gills and fins. He swims to the merpeople town and rescues Ron, who they have captured, while Victor Crumb helps Hermione. He also brings Fleur Delacour's sister back because Fleur has been attacked on her way there. He comes in last, but is rewarded extra points for chivalry. The last challenge is a maze. At the center is the Triwizard Cup, and the first to find it wins. There are many dangers throughout the maze, but Harry completes it rather quickly. He and Cedric both touch the cup at the same time. There is a flash of light, and they are transported away from Hogwarts into a graveyard. A figure comes toward them and casts a killing curse on Cedric, leaving Harry alone with the murderer. What's going on, and will Harry get out of this alive? Read Harry Potter and the Goblet of Fire to find out.